<laughs> I'm scary. We were just discussing the result of your work. It seems these military men are after you. Lots of I men are after me. Attention. Wait. It does make our goals harder to achieve. The man we're after has gone into hiding, protected by his soldiers. We fight our way in then. Not possible, even for a man of your abilities. But I have another. Man, nice you mean no shit. You will be our prisoner, and we shall present you for the bounty. <laughs> then we take off and leave you to die. Yeah, I don't know either, game. You tell me. Oh shit. You ain't the boss of me. This is gonna hurt. Oh, no. Let's see, this is what happens when you get a running start. Shit, really? They got injured? It had like a 95% chance of success. Assassins. In my part of New York, these men defied the curfew set in place for your safety. They assaulted His Majesty's soldiers and conspired against the authority of the military. Such blatant disregard. Oh, well, just the old fashioned one. Designed to protect the citizens of New York will be punished by death. We seek not to control you, to oppress you. We seek only to ensure your safety in the face of conflict and aggression. The civilians of New York must be protected at all costs, no matter their allegiance. It seems that these three men sought to jeopardize your well-being. Ah, damn. Oh, that works. Let's go. Did he cheat? Oh. So slow. Oh, 
Oh, did you see? Stomp your face! Good, good teamwork, guys. That man, he thought what he was doing was right. He did, as do his brothers. Who was he really? There are powerful organizations who seek control, nothing more. This man belonged to one. It does not surprise me. I don't know who you are, but if you should need my help, I am happy to give it. I'm trying to send you on these dangerous ass missions. And you're gonna have no idea you work for the assassins. Ha. Ah. Sucker. No. No, I don't. Fucking You don't know me. Thank you. Okay. Oh, if I would have fallen off the entire thing, I would have left my ass. On. Down you go. My everlasting gratitude, sir. Oh, I have to deliver this shit. Do diggity do dig do diggity.
Of course it was. like a bitch yeah seriously I mean these malevolent pages are assholes Let me up, please. Thank you. Oh, no. Time to get my hot spot tra fast travel on. Torches, no, not from Aha. This might be an interesting twist.
Fury, huh? Fairy tales? Uh, besides the Disney stuff, not so much. Came from? Doctor Wings. Doctor Wales or just Doc. And the power that he was able to use was the power that he managed to use the struggle was the ability to bring back the dead. Hmm. That doesn't sound like something Disney does. No, it really doesn't, but then again, based off of Disney, the was not necessarily a good person from Snow White. Turns out that she really was. Just kind of disguised as a kind of funny Hmm, that doesn't sound familiar. I know, right? I'm like, where is he from? I mean, I found Captain Hook already. We just were introduced to Captain Hook. Come on, people. Captain Hook's pretty boss. Okay, sure. It actually makes a little bit of sense, doesn't it? No, maybe. Rumpel Stilskin is an evil person <sighs> later on inside his life could not find happiness. So he locked himself into a castle. And then he was called to assist somebody else inside a ward. Since he's a man of deals, he decided, fine. I will offer your kingdom to win this war, but in exchange, I get Bell. Uh, be my servant. Let me try, try looking that guy up. You try looking him up. I have, but I can't find any fairy tales that go just based off of the main doctor. It's like, come on! Seriously! Hmm. Maybe they made him up. Maybe they made that character up. How if I know? Or was it? So he was on drugs. That was his thing. Religion to the left of all nations. So, 
Alright, so that means the cross goes on the left. There we go. So, so you're telling me because he had fairy dust, so he was a drug. Oh, so, and you said it, I thought you said everyone had anything to do with drugs. Oh, it doesn't name for drug. It's for PCP, bro. But I call progress. <laughs> so, yeah. This, this particular TV series has all the fairy tales that you've ever known, it goes more in depth. I was kind of hoping, I was kind of hoping that he would just fall from the sky. But I guess that was asking for too much. I was just I was hoping he came up from the sky. That was kind of my, I was just kind of hoping for that. Because that's really. Guess what they usually do, yeah. Get do not tell you. Oops. Playing a Facebook game over. What do you mean every single guard? I mean every red circle inside an entire city have you ever killed. You can't do that because they just respawn. And That's what I said. It was just like I was just playing Fallout 3, and I'm like in Rivet City. And I'm like I'm pretty sure the guard population is higher than the entire population of the city. And for some reason, it was because they actually respawn. So even though I end up killing like everybody in the town because I was going, I was my doing fucking whatever. Because I was doing my being evil, my chaotic dumb playthrough. Which I pretty much just wander into every town to start killing everybody for no reason. The guards were always re the guards would respawn, so it would just end up being retarded. Because there are way more guards than there were actual citizens, actual named citizens. And uh, waste everybody's time. There's way too many goddamn collectibles in this game. But yeah, it was end up being like end up being really weird. Get down. Oh. Uh I'm not exactly sure why that happened. Yeah, that was that was a good angle to jump off of. I don't know. I don't know anymore. What's Dang you bastard! Get down! 
I'm getting really pissed off with these guards just hanging out on the rooftops all the time. What the fuck was that? Like he didn't shot me. That bullet is a magic bullet. Just killed JFK. Yeah. Yeah, it's just that round <laughs> that that uh, round type bullets. <laughs> Fuck the police. There's that lady just drinking right out the bottle. Uh huh. I didn't. Is this a fort? What's going on here? Can I not liberate this? I can't even go in there. No, this is, that's the that's the weirdest thing about this game, because you know, because in the other ones, when you get the viewpoints, you got all the entirety of the whole freaking map. This there's there's more map than there are viewpoint areas, so you end up. I, I already have all the viewpoints, but this is an area that's outside the viewpoint area. So the only thing, the only way I can map this area is actually running around in it. There's no other way. God, it's so stupid. At that point, I just run around the edges and map all the way around. Alright, uh, my assassin. It didn't mark the. Ah, caramba. So many dumbass collectibles. I think this is the only other town I get to go to, considering that I already have all the assassin recruits I can possibly have right now. So that's a good thing. There's a lot of red squares on this man. What's up? Yo man, that's like fucking hood sh hood style right there. Does someone own that? That's why I can't kill any slaves in this. Oh, actually, they have not even mentioned slaves. They mentioned slaves a little bit, but you don't actually see any slaves. Really? What the fuck is a piece of paper doing all the way up there? On what? And it's just and it's just staying there. Oh my god! And my assassins are feeling. Caught on what? Caught on the fucking air! What, what did I even do? Oh man, this is just... <laughs> he just showed up at the haystack. Oh well, both my master assassins just got knocked the fuck out, but the recruits doing okay. Not anymore. I'm just wearing a skin. I'll be fine. Tell her the 
drink. Nah, he's just gonna lay down there for a little bit. How are you feeling? I'll be alright, Connor. Thanks for asking. Yeah, he says he'll be alright. You? Looks worse than it is. I'm alright. Oh. <laughs> I got combos for days, girl. You're mad. You can eat stupid cat. Okay, everyone okay? Yeah, they'll, they'll just get up. But everybody died because of this stupid goddamn piece of paper. See, this this is this is the I I, I think I mentioned this on the on this video last video before, but this this is a conspiracy. The evil almanac pages. Benjamin Franklin's evil almanac pages is, is the cause of blame for everything that happens in this universe. Man, it's fucking. It's so stupid. What do I get out of it, even? I only get like stupid. They only get stupid, stupid crafting recipes that I don't even craft. Did you get it? I'm in a state of not fucking caring. I should probably visit the shop. Actually, nah. I like these colors, alright. For some reason, I could switch back into my prison outfits if I felt like totally undermining the whole seriousness of this game. Oh, this game is definitely serious. It's all serious business. Oh yeah, halfway. See, look at this shit. I don't know what the... I don't even know how this worked this fucking thing anymore. Uh, iTunes, like right here, like all everything on everything on the left is like made into that one tab. Like you can't drag stuff to your iPhone to your media anymore. It comes up on a separate tab, and if you're in, you can only auto, if you want to take something from, if you you can't even update a whole playlist on it now. You have to autofill it from there, from inside the device. Like it looks nice. But it's very, it's very. So you can't drag a song from the past songs to playlists. You know, you, yeah, you can't, you can't, for, you can't even do anything here on this menu. Like, I, I get maybe, as far as I figure it out, you can only like go into your device and autofill it out. I don't do it. You see, you drag it. Yeah, I see. You click on it, drag it to the right, and then you just dump it right there. You do that, but when you're on, but if you like, want to say, "Oh, I want to put this playlist on my device," you can't just click and drag it. Yeah, you can't just click and drag on it. You have to go with. You know, that's just what what it does is just it brings you back to your song. It brings you back to your songs, and then lets you. Add whatever you want right to the playlist. Oh. See, like all this stuff is like, and a lot of your stuff is like right up front now instead of having to be like, I go to podcast. Like you see, like all these buttons, like settings. You can actually even instead of having to right click the thing and say update all your update your podcast or some stupid shit like that, you could just click on that. Oh, yeah, it, uh, this looks very nice, but it just it just takes a while to get used to how they do things now. I really do. I really do like uh, how they do some of this stuff right here, though. Like even the background, even the background color changes depending on how what the picture color is. See, like look at that. Look at 
Look, like, that shit looks cool. It's just weird. It's weird. I don't know if I like it or not. I mean, I like it, but it's just. I don't know. I don't know why they. Yeah, I don't know why they decided to change it so much, though. Like, this is like a. Uh, no, I have a Yahoo. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, I used to have a Hotmail. Actually, my, actually my Xbox Live. Yeah, I'm a... Wow. Hey, yeah, it's just like my face. It's just like, uh. Shit, I totally forgot what I was gonna say. Yeah, it was just weird. Yeah, Windows 8 though. I heard Windows 8. I heard Windows 8's not that different. Eh, I'm not a big fan of touchscreen really. I don't know, I just find touchscreen weird. Like every time, like I still don't know how to work some of the, I still don't know how to do some stuff off my iPhone really. Like for, like when I'm doing web pages, I can somehow, man, I can somehow just go right back up to the top. Ah, fuck. Oh hey, someone someone has reached the rank of assassin. Ooh. That's from 2009 though. I this. This is so Do you do you understand this? Minus the gay soldier chef. That is, what is this? It's a laptop. That is a pretty gay shoulder strap. Yeah, but think about it. Being able to roll up your laptop like that, right? <laughs> it allows you to have it as either a tablet or a laptop or two different screens. All you gotta do is use the main cylinder as a power cord. <laughs> Power base. That's it. Does that not look awesome? Yeah, that's pretty good. And then, hey, look, you wanted a tablet. Ta da! And you get the stylus. Nah, I don't know about this music, though. Okay, seriously, <laughs> it's just like an introduction video for. Product, but they have made it. People can dream though, huh? Can't they? Seriously. That, that main cylinder is both the speaker and the power system. Nice. And the freaking hard drive. And the RAM. It's like, holy shit. You got all that right there? Yeah, the shoulder shop's mild to get. <laughs> but think about it. Who would steal? Something that looks like a cylinder on your side. I don't know. I, I, I've actually had a laptop stolen before. Yeah, but nobody would know that was a laptop. <laughs> Fucking, I was just say it was a bomb. I would carry it around and say, I'm gay. It's like, who would steal a gay man's uh, purse? Who would steal a gay man's purse? Uh, uh, Crayler, people from, uh, I'm not even getting into that. <laughs> People from Korea, barely speak English, standing in the bus stop. So, what can I do for you, Mania? You know, I really wish this fucking GameStop web wasn't fucking glitchy as fuck. 
Yeah, because you get a pre, you get a, you get an extra mission and it has Captain Kid Sawtooth Cutlass. Like it's pretty glitchy. It keeps disappearing on me. The sword you get from the mission. Now actually, it seems fr nothing's. Let's roll with that because that looks stupid. Like, why are all these weapons? Why are they all terrible? Let's see, light blue outfit has red and blue dark exits. Dark brown outfit has red. Since I figure it's winter, I feel like I should dress in dark colors. We'll never see what's never see it coming. I don't understand the prices of these weapons at all. Like why are some of like the that, why are some of the weapons so worse than the other ones? I'm just curious what you're buying. Because I don't have anything else to buy with. What else am I gonna buy shit with? Nothing. I have so much goddamn money. Oh yes, the fucking feathers. It's just like huge money sinks. Like I don't even know. That looks pretty sick. I like that outfit. Yeah, now I gotta go save George Washington's ass for like the twentieth time. Or some shit. I don't know. I just spent. Now that happened after the war, if I remember my history, but while I was being president and stuff like that. This picture, yeah, maybe, because you know people analyze the pictures, and it looks like he's got some severe mouse discomfort, discomfort in this picture. You must have wooden teeth. But as far as I know, that was that was possibly after the war. I think. I know where a feather goes. Do you? Oh my God, that's that is some Assassin's Creed, Assassin's Creed. Valley Forge. Seriously, that was a big ass sword. Not as this one. For one hand. Yeah. Except, the, except I can guarantee you, Connor's gonna use it as a regular sword. Not as a tipping point. Why is that funny to you? Yeah, almost. Uh, yeah, okay, yeah, I got that part. Is that the funny part to you? Is that your humor? <laughs> I'm gonna rape you, noob! That's like doing this. I wish. I don't know what I'm doing out here. I guess I'm gonna, I'm gonna stay on this fucking trail so I don't get mauled by a fucking bear. Bears are tough. What's that guy? Uh, isn't that the same as that guy we just passed? Yes. 
That was during during fucking John during the we were riding with uh, John Pierre. The alert, everyone tell the British is coming. Every time you go, every time you go to one of the, the Patriots houses and you knock on the door and let everybody know what's going on, it's always the same fucking dude who came to the door. I'm like, why? What is going on? It's like I think we're being portrayed here. Something's some cartoony goofy shit's going on here. Can't pet. Don't want to pet the dog. Let me pet the dog. And of course, look at the badass cave. How can you not tell? Commander. Connor. Any word on Lee? Not yet. My apologies. I've been distracted. No, he's got YT. Yeah, it's like Supply I said, it happened after the war. The camp have gone missing. I suspect treachery. A traitor named Benjamin Church recently released. Isn't this where the student? Prison. Isn't this where the? Uh, this, uh, the two events are surely traitor. related. The church. Uh, what was his crime? Isn't this where the soldier he handbook was, sending letters to was the made letters here? Detailing our troop strength. Do you remember even reading the soldier's handbook? He claimed it was you a got a basic. That we might have I lost war. mine, and then I ended up taking taking somebody else's. Because, because, no, no. nah. I will find church for you. Hmm? Why? What reason have you? The American to Revolution. Does it matter? As you wish. No, I'm just saying. Wasn't it made we here at the sword? The ports of trouble along the southern road. Wasn't that the story? Might be he's responsible. This George Washington got like a French man to come down you here, and he's like, "Your troops are shit. I will fix this." Hmm. <laughs> Hey, chill out with my homeboy, George Washington. Commander, I have failed them, Connor. Only look around to know my words are true. This revolution once seemed a righteous thing. Our cause, pure and just. We asked only for what all people deserve. Liberty, equality, and respect. The Empire should have embraced us. Instead, they pushed for war. R-E-S-P-E-C-T, find out what it means to me. I dare to dream of better things. And why not both? Behold what it has brought. Such dark thoughts will cripple a man. But only if he lets them. Look again. Out there stand men and women determined to be free. Such a struggle is rarely easy and never without sacrifice. I've often asked myself a thousand times if I would not be happier back amongst my people, living a quieter, simpler life. But if I abandon my cause, if you abandon yours, Commander, who would take our places? And what would become of the people who rely upon us? It isn't right that they should suffer when I do not. If the ground must be their mattress, so too will it be mine. And what about the storm? If I can't take a stand against the snow, then there really is no hope for us. The gold W. What news do you bring me? No news, Commander. I was merely curious how your assistants were faring. Without them, we would be lost. It's as simple as that. With Lafayette drilling our men, it's possible our next engagement will not be one-sided. Have you had the opportunity to meet Casimir Pulaski? I have not. Unfortunate. He's another of these soldiers we've hired from overseas. Polish man capable of fighting on horseback the likes of which I have never seen. I intend to name him commander of the horse, and when spring comes and the battles resume, 
the regulars will fear the charge of his Patriot cavalry. I look forward to that day, Commander. As do I, Connor. As do I. All right, let's find out who's been taking these supplies. Mistake. This was a mistake. Come on, horsey, you can do it. Fine, you go to the entrance. No oh, shit! Father. Hey, Connor. Dad. Any last words? Wait. A poor choice. <laughs> Come to check up on church? Make sure he's stolen enough for your British brothers? Benjamin Church is no brother of mine. No more than the Redcoats or their idiot king. Oh, I expected naivete, but this... The Templars do not fight for the crown. We seek the same as you, boy. Freedom, justice, independence. What? Hmm? But what? Johnson, Pitcairn, Hickey. They sought to steal land, to sack towns, to murder George Washington. Johnson sought to own the land, that we might keep it safe. Pitcairn aimed to encourage diplomacy, which you cocked up thoroughly enough to start a goddamn war. And Hickey? George Washington is a wretched leader. He's lost nearly every battle in which he's taken part. The man's racked with uncertainty and insecurity. Only look at Valley Forge to know my words are true. We're all better off without him. Look, uh. much as I'd love to spar with you, Benjamin Church's mouth is as big as his ego. You clearly want the supplies he's stolen. I want him punished. Our interests are aligned. And what do you propose? A truce. Perhaps... Perhaps some time together might do us good. You are my son, after all, and might still be saved from your ignorance. You know you have me. I can kill you now, if you prefer. I like you to see you try. Excellent. Shall we be off? Do you even know where Benjamin Church has gone? I'm afraid not. I'd hoped to ambush him when he or one of his men returned here. It seems I'm too late. They've come and cleared the place out. I may be able to track him.
Let's beat your ass. No, I can't shoot you. Kind of wretch control from your territory. Right in front of you, just being in. inside the crates. Medical supplies and clothing as well. <laughs> Let's see if we can keep up, Dad. Ha, that's what I thought. Fuck you. Can't catch up to me, can you? <laughs> Guy here's something in the snow. Snow has obscured the tracks, but enough remains that we can still follow. Hey, what's up? Just when I look, going to freeze to death if I don't get this fixed. Are you Ben Church's man? Well played. <laughs> Good chase. It was not wise to run. What do you want? Where is Benjamin Church? I don't know. We was riding for a cup just north of here. It's where we normally unload the cargo. Maybe you'll find him there. Oh shit! Not that. You did not have to kill him. Let's not waste time with all this pointless banter. Go catch up with the rest of Church's men. Infiltrate that camp of theirs and see what you can discover. Or what about an you? there? Have you mind? Just do as I ask. Bitch. Micro management. Mozzie. It was a good haul today. Saw a bit of gunpowder in those crates. We'll get extra for that. I church will be pleased and we'll be rich. I don't know. I Fuck. The Yanks shivering and starving out there. So Kinda does, I can't remember. All they need to do is raise some high flat. <laughs> oh really? Wasn't it, well, wait, wasn't the doctor's name supposed to Frankenstein?
What is this madness? I'm not a man.